So as you can see, this is our new time. 2.29. Considering that our original run was one hour, and this is the total time of two and a half hours, this was one and a half hours of Zangetsu alone. Which, that's honestly not too bad. But it is definitely longer and harder. But... There's still more that we need to do. Zangetsu has realized his weakness. And it's time to make amends. Also, if you didn't notice, yes, Stage 8 is now called Cleave the Moon. Let's start from the beginning. And let's see if we can handle the situation differently. Differently again. I'm really just kind of avoiding everything now. That's that's uncharacteristic. Oh, like we've been through here a bunch of times now. Figure you guys probably want me to rush through this area for the umpteenth time. So let's try not to slow down so much. Give me this again, why not? Come on, get the lamp. Kind of important. Alright, here we are again. Also, 4444, four, 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 probably a reference to death, since, in case you don't know, one of the main pronunciations for 4 in Japanese is she, and death is pronounced the same way. In Japanese, anyway. Just your unlucky number trivia. Oh, I actually would have hit him if I didn't hesitate there. Alright, there we go. First boss is done once again.
so, we've talked. We've left her alone. What else is there that we can do? Well, what is about to happen may not be for those sensitive of the heart. So please, avert your eyes until after the beep. A new soul art has stirred within you. Beep. Crescent Moon. So now, Zangetsu has a new move. It's this. It's... It seems a bit underwhelming when you first get it. But it's actually a decent tool. 